Hello everybody, John here with a news update about Oumuamua, the pencil or cigar shaped asteroid that entered our solar system a few months ago, which is currently on its way out into deep space. Uh, recently, mainstream science announced that Oumuamua could be a piece of alien technology. So we'll be looking at the implications of that statement in this video. One of the articles I'll be referencing, I'll include the links to all these in the description below. Mystery interstellar asteroid Oumuamua could be gigantic alien solar sail to look for signs of life. This was posted to the Evening Standard earlier today. The mysterious asteroid Oumuamua has been analyzed by astronomers from the Harvard Smithsonian Center for Astrophysics after it was found to be unexpectedly speeding up. One of the professors told University Today, quote, Oumuamua could be an active piece of alien technology that came to explore our solar system the same way we hope to explore Alpha Centauri using Starshot and similar technologies, end quote. This is an artist's impression back then of what uh, a Mua Mua is thought to look like. Long pencil, cigar shaped object with uh, traces of metallic material also found to be slightly reddish in color. This article posted to Sky and Telescope on the 10th of November 2017 shows the strange trajectory and uh, the dotted line shows the path the object followed as it came into our solar system and then uh, slung shot past the sun and uh, is on its way out into deep space again and scientists are saying the object is speeding up as it's leaving the solar system. An article posted to the Astrophysical Journal in which they talk about um, narrow band signals from Oumuamua what the scientists did at Murchison Wildfield Array is they scanned the frequency range 72 to 102 megahertz at 10 kilohertz steps for traces of um, radio frequency emissions from the object. However, they didn't find any in the period of study, but it has prepared them for future similar events. Interesting that um, although they speculate that this is nothing more than a strange asteroid that came into our solar system, they still went ahead and scanned the object for narrowband signals. And uh, this comes to the crux of the matter. We're looking at similar anomalies that were spotted near Mars. The Phobos II incident of 1989 where um, Phobos II failed to communicate with Earth as scheduled after completing an operation yesterday around the Martian moon Phobos. Scientists at Mission Control have been unable to establish stable radio contact this is one of the photographs that was taken of the moon Phobos just before the orbiter was taken out and together with the moon we can see this long pencil or cigar shaped object and uh, another photograph was snapped on the Martian surface showing the shadow of a very long massive pencil or cigar shaped object. There's a video you can watch in this article that goes into a little more detail. And then uh, to the Curiosity rover and 
and uh, a series of photographs taken of this long pencil or cigar shaped object orbiting the planet. This photograph or range of photos was taken on 2014 April 28. First photograph was snapped at 448 and then uh, the last one at 458. So this object was visible for at least 8 to 10 minutes. That's not a typical asteroid streak of light flashing past the uh, Curiosity rover's camera. This is an animation made from the couple of frames that were snapped. So you can definitely see this object has some structure and a fixed length and width. So could it be that um, Muamua and similar cigar shaped objects photographed by eyewitnesses on Earth are actually alien craft and the interesting announcement by mainstream science about this object uh, gives us conspiracy theorists some hope that could, this could be another step closer to disclosure. So let's keep an eye on this developing story. Thanks again to my new subscribers for joining and uh, my regular subscribers and viewers, thank you for watching for giving thumbs up and sharing and as well as uh, providing your analysis in the comments below. So do let me know what you make of this. I look forward to reading your comments. I'll see you all in the next episode. Thanks for watching. Bye bye for now.